Ready? Go. In a civilized world, the need for mobility has created a large amount of traffic as well as pollution and CO2 in the air. This is how Lisbon is decreasing its carbon footprint. will decrease when the public transport footprint increases. Portugal is one of the six countries in EU to already hit a CO2 target emission set by the European Commission of 2030. The tram began here in Lisbon in 1872. The trams run smoothly and saves three times the energy of that of buses. Using buses and trams removes thousands of car journeys per day on the roads, which reduces the input of pollutants. Kerish is the company of public transportation here in Lisbon. In 2008, Kerish was ranked 8th in the climate responsibility ranking. In 2011, it introduced its first hybrid bus around the city of Lisbon. And in 2012, Kerish received certification for social responsibility standard. Between 2007 and 2011, Portugal expanded its renewable energy by 35%. And in 2016, the whole country went four days with 100% renewable energy. In 2009, Mobi-E was inaugurated. It is an electric vehicle charging network that became in Porto and here in Lisbon. Last year, Lisbon also began Gira, which is a bicycle program, an electrical bicycle or a regular bicycle that you can take around the city for 45 minutes for free, or you can pay a 25 euro yearly fee. By 2020, the country aims to reduce its primary energy consumption by 25% as well as 10% of the public transportation to come from renewable energy. For four and a half days in May 2016, the entire country of Portugal ran on renewable sources such as wind, solar and hydro. What is your country doing to decrease its carbon footprint?